Hi there, this is Matt Steck with Nasuni. Today I'm going to be giving a quick demo of the backup recovery functionality of Nasuni, um, both through the Nasuni Management Console, as if you were an administrator, and from a Windows previous version's perspective from the end user. So, uh, first and foremost, we're going to go ahead and we're going to browse into our um, share here. I'm going to go to this folder. Now, let's say a user just happens to delete a folder or a file that they, they actually want to keep, right? I delete this corporate deck. Now, my options here are, if I want to leverage Microsoft previous versions, I would simply you know, have to go back, browse to the previous folder. Uh, since I deleted the file, I can't actually look at previous versions of that file. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to look at previous versions of the entire, um, of the entire folder. So I'll go here, and I will, uh, I will open this version. And as you can see, as soon as I click on that, I will see that file system. And what I could simply do is just go ahead, drag and drop this from the uh, previous version that's listed up here into um, my current folder, thus restoring that file. Now, let's say I instead decided rather than using previous versions, I wanted to call the help desk and have an administrator uh, restore that file for me. Through the Nissany Management Console, uh, the administrator would simply browse to the volumes tab come into the file browser and what you'll see here is we will get a complete view of the entire file system through our browser. So as it loads the root here, um, I'm gonna browse to my folder system here and you can see again that that corporate deck is not currently listed because it is not part of the current file system. So what I would do is I would change the version up at the top here uh, and let's just grab a timestamp from earlier uh, today. I grab that file and as you can see, there's that corporate deck that existed at that point in time. And I'm going to go say, restore that file. Now, as with any traditional backup, I could restore this somewhere within a different location. Uh, as the file doesn't exist, uh, you know, backup existing doesn't help me here. But if the file still existed and I wanted to make a backup of it before I did that, or if I needed to preserve the directory structure in case of a long restore, I could do that as well. I click restore file. Now, what's actually happening here is rather than having to go and pull that file from some third party media, um, all that's happening in the Nasuni file system is we're basically tracking and looking at those previous um, objects that existed uh, to that given point in time to restore that file. So there's no copy that has to happen. It's simply just a remapping of those objects. And what you'll see as soon as I come in here and look at this, that boom, there is my file back restored to its original location. And I can go ahead and open that. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one.